Hello Minecraft friends, this is Truthany. Welcome back to Journey Through Minecraft episode 66. It has been a long time and we were working on this, uh, but I think I need to make some adjustments to this because there shouldn't be this break right here. And so I think I need to move this two blocks this way and then it'll be right. So. I'm going to make those changes probably offline so you don't have to watch it. What I really want to do today is kind of, well not kind of, but go traveling somewhere and find a cherry blossom forest. Because I'd love to see a cherry blossom forest on my own or in person, not on my own, in person. So we are going to go and travel some. Let's go out. I think I have, oh. What did I just do? I just threw my sword. Where is it? Where is my sword? Where did it go? Oh my gosh. There it is. Oh. He hit me. There. Got my sword. Actually, pre accidentally pressed the wrong button. <laughs> Alright, let's get back to our boat. And go this way. So I wanted to see if I have, oh, I did it again. I keep hitting down on the D-pad. Where is it? For the inventory, because another game I'm playing, that's what you have to do, but it's not. It's Y. So I don't have a bed, so I need to get a bed. I know where a bed's at, because we don't want to be traveling without a bed. It's dangerous all right uh, here's our turtles get our turtle a friend hello foxy let's get this bed all right I did it again probably need to get rid of some of this stuff too if we're gonna travel I don't know why I didn't do that before we left because we were building so I had all this inventory uh, let me put this all away. Now I am playing grounded. And that's why I keep pressing down. Because that's how you get to the inventory and grounded. But in this game, it's not. One thing I do really like about grounded is how you press down and put away all your stuff. And it will put all your stuff away in <clears throat> any boxes that have similar items all right let's see put that away put that right here wish they'd do that in this game they'd be kind of cool all right sorry about that something's happening in my throat put that right there for now and let's find where these go what is this? All oh, these are wool. I need to put wool somewhere. Where's my wool? I think this is my wool. <clears throat> Excuse me. All right, put that away. Put that away. Where's my wood? Where's my wood? That's not my wood. Okay. There's a sign. Let's put that away. Put that there. That. Oh, that's wool. Could put that away. And where's the ice? Where is the ice? Okay. And go back to the wool. Put this brown wool away. And then we can put it this way as well. Alright. I think. Oh, we could put this away too. All right, sorry about that. My allergies got to me, so I had to pause a little bit. All right, so I think we got everything. We just need to put this scaffolding away. We probably don't need that. Oh, we don't need this for right now either. Put that there. And my bucket, I probably don't need my bucket. Let's put my bucket here. And we want some space so we can collect stuff as we go. Where is, where did I put my bamboo stuff? All right, don't think it's there. 
I'll just put it here for now. All right, so now we're ready. We're ready to go. Look at that. I keep throwing it. We got everything cleared. Let's put a bow here. Put our bed here. And we got food. All right. All right, good thing it's not dark yet. Let's go back to the boat. And we'll travel around. Now, there's some sections on the mm, overall map I have not gotten to. So, hopefully we could get to a spot where it'll generate a cherry blossom forest or some other type of forest. Uh, it looks like it's getting dark, so we'll probably go ahead and need to sleep. Uh, come on, come on. Where are you? Sun is almost down. Uh, the bamboo is looking good. It's growing. Our little bamboo forest over here. Right. Okay. All right. Let's, it's daytime, so we could go. Let's get in our boat and go. Yeah, if we could get a panda, we could have a little panda zoo with the bamboo. All right. I know we've traveled different ways, so we're gonna head this way. The third digit on our positioning, we're going to just keep going until we get to a spot that will be land. And I'll probably fast forward this uh, so you don't have to watch me going all the way through. We should have probably brought a map so we can map some of these places out around our base area so we remember exactly where we've been and where we have not been uh, maybe next time found we found an underwater temple let's make sure we mark this uh, position so we could come back here oh shucks so we can come back here and collect some stuff there I don't have I don't have the proper equipment to actually go in there and do anything here I go again. I'm gonna get killed. But look at that, that's so cool. They're coming to get me. Go, go back up. All right. I don't have the proper equipment to actually go underwater. I don't have the breathing helmets or any of that stuff and I, have, I don't have bre underwater breathing potions so we're just gonna have to come back but that is cool so we're at 180 negative 185 and negative 1885 we we'll have to remember that or just go back to this video to find it oh let's go over there see what that is that looks like forget what this biome is called but we should find that mushroom cow yes we need to mark this position as well there there's the cow let's go let's do a little bit of exploring over here we have not been here yet, I don't believe, but this is great. It's not too far from our 
our base position and it's about to get dark so let's see where are you son so he's she's almost down so I think it's called a mushroom cow and this is a mushroom island comment on the on the in the chat and let me know okay there you go Let's get our bed. Still moving slow because of that spell. See if the if you look at the top right of my screen, it's like a slow spell, a slow mining spell or something like that. Come on, you can do it. Any day. One day, yeah, this spell is horrible underwater because you already have slowness in mining, anyways. And then when you get this spell put on you, it makes it even worse. All right, let's see if we can see. So, here, I thought if you put your cursor on, the you're able to see exactly what kind of animal it is. I don't want to kill it because <clears throat> you can collect a special type of soup from them if you have a bowl. Let me see. I have enough. And I don't have a crafting table. Let's get a crafting table just so we can show you all. And then you can make a bowl. Let's get a bowl. Is it a bowl or I think? Yeah. I think it is a bowl. There you go. Oh my gosh. Keep pressing down. All right. So here's a mushroom stew you can get from the cows. I wish these were stackable instead of being separate boxes of their own. But I understand. I understand why. But it doesn't make sense because you can stack the... the cooked cod as well so why not make that stackable but you can drink this well I thought you could drink it mm. oh I thought you could drink I thought you could drink the, the stew oh maybe it's just because I have that dumb spell on me all right Let's see. Let's see if we could see what that spell is called. Uh, it didn't show. It didn't show a status. I thought, gosh, I played so many different games that some games will show you the status you have when you go to the inventory or you could click on your character screen. And it'll show you a different status, but here it just shows in the top right. Um, all right, so let's see if we can, no, can't. I thought you could eat, eat the stew, but it doesn't seem like it. I'm gonna take half, let's try to take half. <laughs> um, can't take half. Let's see, recipe book. No, I thought you could you could eat that, but I guess not. But this this is a cool island. It's fairly rare to find one of these, so we got a bit lucky. And it looks like there's something deep down there too. So, well, we know what position this is. We're our goal for this this episode is to find a cherry forest. So we'll continue on. Let's see. Good thing is we found a, two things that um, we'll need later. All right. Thank you, cows. I think they're called mushroom cows. Why is it still dark? It seems dark. All right. Keep going on. And what we'll probably do is I'll put a portal here. 
and remember we made some connecting minecart portals like a kind of a freeway or a subway system <clears throat> we could get there a lot faster than going on the overworld all right so let's see there's some squids Well, there's some land that we finally got to. There's some horses. There's some tropical fish I saw over here too. Usually when there's tropical fishes like that, means that there's a coral reef. And there's a cave in there. That's pretty cool. Oops, let me go back up. I can breathe. <laughs> okay, um, let's continue on. It's just a normal island. I believe we have acacia wood already. But it looks like this place is. Um, there's some llamas here. Hello, llamas. Hello, pretty llama. And there's some horses. So this is a good spot too. Well, we may make a, uh, like a little waterfall down there. We may make a little base over here. Let's see what, what this goes down to. Can't really see. It goes pretty deep down there. All right, so I believe we have acacia wood. I think we found some acacia wood. If not, we got the positioning here. If we need to come back, there's my boat. Our goal is a cherry forest. Let's see if we can find one of those. Hello, horses. I'll come back for you guys. You guys let me know what's the best way to transport animals through the portal. I've seen a few YouTube videos of it, but it's been a while. Let's see. Because there's, oh, nice. I think we're coming to a Mesa biome. Yeah, very nice. This is great because this is uh, there's different colors of clay that we can collect from here. What's that? Is that a creeper that almost went off? Yeah, th <clears throat> yeah this is great because we could collect the these different types of uh, clay blocks. Uh, let me show you. So. The terracotta blocks. This is the orange one. We can get some brown ones uh, over there and some yellow ones and then the neutral ones I believe. Oops. Let's see. I can't I can't remember if we've already collected some of these but well we know where they're at now so we'll make a end a portal or not end a portal, but a one of the portals. And well, we could come back here and collect some of those things after we find our, oops, oh my, my chest armor is almost broken. I didn't even notice that. We should have fixed it before we left. All right, let's go back out this way. It's cool. Something we need. Ah, uh, here's the coral. Here's the coral reef. I knew there was a coral reef. This is great because we can make a fish tank. We'll collect some fish, some of the coral down there. Um, a lot of fish. Very nice. So we found a few good things. I don't know if we found any of these before. But if we haven't, we have now. Hmm, that uh, Mesa biome 
is fairly large and I I don't know if that is called a Mesa Bio or if it's called the Badlands I know there's one that's very similar to it and it's called the Badlands so if you know let me know in the comments all right go to sleep Oh, I need my bed. All right, let's get my bed and let's continue on our journey. So we found a coral reef, that's great. Some, what well, I don't think it's a badlands, I think it's the mesa biome. And we just need to find a cherry blossom for us. And we're definitely not going to find it here in the desert. Oh, our number is going down. Oh. We're going the wrong way. We're supposed to go this way. Alright, there you go. We're headed back the right way, gents and ladies. Here's our beautiful coral reef. Lots of coral. Stuff to find down there, looks like. Well, folks, look what we have found. We've accomplished our goal. Awesome. Look at this. Looks like a cherry blossom forest. Not a very big one, but one nonetheless. Here we go. That is awesome. So excited. We'll collect some of these trees. Oh, it actually extends out over here some too. Nice, very nice. Oh yeah, look at that people. Oh, we got some flowers too, yes. Oh nice, look at that. Wonder if we could collect these without destroying them. Yep, sure did. Oh, let's see. All right, oh look at that. We got some pink petals. Awesome. We'll collect some of those. We'll collect a stack of them. Because once they start growing in our area, we can kind of farm them. All right, let's go get some more of our pink petals. These look like small ones. This look like a little bit bigger. Uh, let's see. It's time to get dark. I didn't want the grass seed, but whatever. It's so pretty. I want to see a really big one, but this is great. All right, let's put our bed down. Go to sleep. We don't want any creepers sneaking up on us. This is fantastic, people. All right. I'm glad we were able to find it fairly quickly. And so what I will do is make a portal over here as well. Okay, see how many we have. Oh, wow. Well. Well, that was pretty fast. So I guess we'll just make two stacks since we've already started a second stack. And make sure we watch the second stack. Look, that's pretty, isn't it? <laughs> that's so pretty. Let's check. 41. Fifty-one. Yeah, they're really big clusters. Give us a lot. Sixty. And four more. 
see what that gave us. Okay. Um, we'll put that here. And we'll replant it. There you go. And so that will grow. Uh, let's get some of the wood. Oh, there's a bee over here. I wonder if there's a beehive. And we're going to wait for seeds to drop. Hey, look, Mr. Bee, is that your, that's not your beehive, is it? No. So the cherry trees are very similar to, very similar to acacia and how it grows, it looks like. Where's the other branch? Did I get the branches? All of them? Yeah. All right, let's see if we collected some seeds already. Uh, those are pink petals. Here's our cherry log. Awesome. And for some reason, I don't understand why we can't eat our stew. Okay, now we just need to wait for seeds to drop. Hold on, let me see if that's preventing it from dropping. Okay. There's some right there. Yes, we got two of them so far. The cherry saplings, nice. We'll go ahead and collect some more wood so more saplings will drop. I don't know if this is one here. Yeah, it looks like it is. Very good, very good. There is the bee. We don't want to disturb that, so we're going to leave that alone. All right. That's pretty neat. There's a beehive. That's that's good to know that they grow on cherry trees as well, because I know that I believe they're limited to the oak and the birch, so they do spawn up on cherry trees as well. Very nice. Let's see if we can get some more saplings. Hopefully, find some more. Let's go up here and collect this one. This one has a good amount. Yeah, oh shoot. Oh. Okay, I think that's it. Yeah. Yeah, that's one one thing with these trees like the acacia wood where the branches all kind of branch all over the place. You have to make sure you find where it's all branching so that you don't leave one and then you have a hanging tree, which nobody nobody in Minecraft really cares for. We want you to cut down the whole tree. Don't let anything be laying, stay hanging. We don't want any floating trees. Alright, let's see if we get some more saplings over here. Looks like we do. Collect these over here. Hope you guys are having a good Saturday afternoon or Saturday. Enjoying some time with some family and friends. I had a lot planned uh, today, but... I wanted to get a recording done so I could go ahead and edit that and get that out to you guys. Um, and something's going on with my foot, so I'm not able to really go outside and do a whole lot because it just hurts like crazy. But it doesn't hurt my hands, so I'm able to record and play. It's always a nice excuse. Though, I wish I, my foot wasn't hurting. And I could go outside and do some stuff. Because there's a lot of stuff that needs to be done in my yard. I wanted to finish my pool awning. I can't really get that done today. One, it's very hot outside. Oh my gosh, it's like super, super hot. It's like a hundred and something degrees with 100% uh, humidity. Not fun weather to be outside. Alright, let's see how much we've collected so far. Only... 58 but we got 12 saplings which is nice 
uh, the more saplings we have the better then we'll plant our own cherry forest at home base I would like I should have brought I should have brought a uh, portal material so we could create a portal and see where we're at oh my gosh look at that drop Ooh, there's stuff down there too looks like there's some light down there I wonder what that is I wonder if that's just lighting from the outside get these saplings I don't really want to fall over there because that's a huge fall hi pig and there's mr. B hi mr. B how are you are you doing good today that's great you look very happy glad you enjoyed the new cherry forest all right we got some more sounds like we got some more Let's see if we get some more down here I know I've said this several times but I love what uh, developers are doing in Minecraft uh, the Minecraft world is beautiful there's a lot of stuff that you could s see now in the caves and um, you know in the overworld but the caves aren't as as dull anymore you can see a bunch of stuff in the caves which I'd love to find one of the what is it called it's not a forest but uh, underground cities uh, I'd like to find one of those and hopefully we'll be able to do that in one of our episodes and use those use that material because I love new material to be able to build stuff so yeah, all right we're doing good on saplings let's cut down another log I All that far <laughs> well summer is almost over for I know a lot of you kids that are still in school and in college back to school you know I, when I was in school I really enjoyed it I, I hear a lot of people that say that they hate high school or they hate school you know find something that you really enjoy and uh, something that makes you happy that that you can go to and know that that's what you're going to when you go to school I enjoyed being with my friends so does my daughter she loves being with her friends so she enjoys school and meeting new people I loved meeting new people I was the battalion commander in my high school and it was always enjoyable to to meet new cadets that are coming into ROTC and just it's just I just it was some of the best time of my life was was high school and, and school in general like I said you just find something that you really enjoy and gravitate to that ignore the noise the people that aren't very nice and the stuff other stuff that goes on that you don't really care for like some people don't really care for say fashion stuff having a new outfits and all those things but some people do let them be let them have and enjoy that because that's their thing you find something that you enjoy if you enjoy Dungeons and Dragons and enjoy role playing with your, your friends or, or do that if you enjoy and gravitate to those people and if you enjoy video games gravitate to gravitate to those type of people if you enjoy sports gravitate to those type of uh, people there's always different types of people are all different unique in our own way and just uh, enjoy that and then like I said ignore the, the other noise the people that aren't very nice and just want to make other people miserable and there's there you're always going to have that regardless in school or in when you're an adult um, you don't have to care for that just ignore it go do your thing and i know people could be mean to, people were mean at, to me at some times uh, i grew up at a time when 
being racist was okay for some people. And you just put, make, make sure that they know that you could come back with something and that you can't be bullied. If you do that, then you'll be fine. And if you are being bullied, make sure you talk to your, your parents about it or your close friends. But definitely your parents. Let your parents know. There's, there's no shame in letting your parents know. And you guys can find a course of action to, to take care of it. All right, let's see. Uh, enough of lecturing from Trethany. Or, I don't know if it's lecturing, but sharing. All right, I think we have a good amount. I wanted to get a whole stack, like 64. So we may get a little bit more. Just hang out a little bit longer to to grab. Let's see, let see we grab. Oh, no, that's the, the B. All right, let's see if we go down here and grab some more. There's one up there. Uh, and I wanted to get a two stacks of the cherry wood so let's see if we can cut down this one I just don't want to fall in <laughs> that big hole <laughs> all right my good buddies have stopped playing with me on on survival games because they're not survival game players and I love survival games my brother he still plays with me once in a while but he easily gets frustrated, so so he doesn't play it that often. Um, but I think I'm going to find a, a good community of Minecraft players so we can enjoy Minecraft together. All right, let's see. Uh, try to get my son to invite me to their realms, but... I get it. Nobody wants your dad playing with them. But you would think that, hey, that's kind of cool. My dad really enjoys it, and I'd like to play with him. But no, no, that's not the case. <laughs> but that's his thing. That's fine. I'm sure he just wants to be able to talk to his friends without worrying about what he says in front of his dad. Because I'm not big in cursing. And... He is, so, you know, that's what he wants to do. He normally doesn't, but he does with his friends. Because I'm sure his friends do too, so that's fine. Doesn't make him bad kids. He knows what's right and wrong. So most of the time he doesn't. It's just when he ha puts on that headset on, then he does. <laughs> All right, he also gets really loud. All right, we are two more from a stack of saplings. We are one more, and I think we will be good. Um, and we're only two away shy of the wood. I'm not gonna cut down another wood. I mean, I could. All right, let's see, did that put a 64? Yep, yeah, sure did. All right, fantastic. So we got us a stack of cherry saplings. We almost got two stacks of cherry logs, which is fine. We only got, and let me make sure. Oh yeah, I, I still have my bed. Uh, we've done our goal of getting us to a sapling forest, which is great. That means we didn't explore too far out the last time when we were playing. And we're able to get one generated on a map that we had, had been to. Oh, look at that. We have a village. Let's go check out the village. And we have some chickens for food. And there's a small patch of cherry forest over there. Um, looks like a birchwood forest next to the cherry, cherry forest. And we have a we have a small town here. Let's go check out this town. Um, let's uh, let's get us some meat and mm. leather from our mm. local friends. Oh look, there's some bees here. That means there is a beehive close. Mm. Man, he flew he flew far. Mm. 
All right, let's get that leather and meat. Oh my gosh, one day I'm gonna remember to keep pressing Y and not down. So, meat's not cooked, but that's okay. We could cook it later. You guys tell me about the stew. I thought there's a way to eat the stew. But when I go to it, I can't eat it. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, I couldn't eat it before because I was full. Duh. <laughs> now I can. Now I can eat it. There you go. All right. Very good. All right. You don't have to comment about it. Oh, well, you can't comment and say, "Duh, tree, Tony. Good job." Mm. <laughs> All right. Uh. Let's uh, let's check this out. Let's check out this forest. I mean, not forest. Jungle. Here's a compost with some with some carrots it looks like uh, let's see if we this is a smithing house so let's see if we can find some cool stuff inside his chest uh, oh yeah look at that I'm gonna need that sir and I'll go ahead and take that thank you sir and we may when we create the portal we're gonna put out here so that we can have a place to go to to sleep up here um, there, there must be a beehive. Oh, there it is. There's the beehive over there. See it, guys? And that's where that bee's coming from, which is great. Um, so when we come back here, we may take that. We'll see. Hello, Mr. Villager. How are you? What are you selling? Um, all right, 12 potatoes. Mr. Farmer for one emerald. What is that? Some kind of orange or a pie. I think that's a pie, pumpkin pie. All right. Good job, guy. Keep farming. Let's see if we can find something here. It's a nice little uh, small castle. Um, and it has a um, potion brewing station here. We have one of these already, I believe. The brewing stand. Uh, we'll take it. In case we want to make an, a, another one all right let's see if there's anything up here i don't think this one is big enough to have another chest all right let's see let's see what we find over here hello i think you need to finish your floor all right i forget what kind of house this is that has the water inside of it. There's kitties, all right. Kitties are great for um, the creepers. They kind of they scare them away, so it's good to keep that. And there's Mr. Iron Man. Here's a bed, there's no chest in here. We don't want to stay here too long, especially when it gets dark, or we have to go sleep right away. And they have a cow farm, that's great. Uh, so we can utilize some of this uh, farming and stuff when we make and there's a sheep we could get a second sheep and there are a lot of villagers over here oh my gosh look at this a lot of farmers and we can change some of these farmers to something else in fact um, I should put this back because this is actually a st station where is this? a station for one of the, the farm uh, one of the villagers to, to kind of have a, a job I think I think I can't remember for sure uh, the kind of job is um, what was it we'll put on a wood because we don't want the we don't want the farmer to have to bend down so much so we'll put it on here and we should see it you should see well maybe not the boom station I thought it creates a job for them but we'll see I think it does. One of them may have to get closer, but you, there it is. That's what you want to look for. So somebody took took over that occupation, and it should be a, a one of the villagers that are close, and we'll see if we can find that person. Uh, may, maybe it's him. Yeah. The fisherman? No, the fisherman? No, it's not him. Maybe he has fishes on his thing. <laughs> I don't think that makes a fisherman. Uh, it, it has to be somebody else. Maybe it does. You can comment. Maybe it's this guy. Huh? 
No, he says a weapon smith, so there must be an uh, anvil or something around here that makes him. I hear some potatoes. I think we have potatoes already growing. Yeah, I think we do. Um, I don't think it's ham. Oh, they're already going to sleep. It means it's getting dark soon, and we're going to need to go to sleep soon as well. We'll take this one. So as soon as it turns dark, um, we will want to go sleep. Because we don't want creepers. Or, oh, maybe that's the guy. We'll go check it out. All right. It turned, it turned dark, so we'll go sleep. So our villagers don't get killed. Or they don't die. Hi, buddy. You have no occupation. Maybe this is what the brewing guy no he, he does with the um stand book stand and it, the book stand i believe makes a librarian so this will be a, a nice town to to shop for some emeralds i see that's over here nothing nothing great okay just a couple more houses and let's let's look at the view over here. Look, it looks like there's a cherry forest over there as well. well that's nice. And there's some a pumpkin farm, a small cherry forest, and that's the cherry forest that we went to. But there's another one there. So this town is surrounded by cherry wood, uh, cherry forest. I think we looked at this one. Oh no, we'll take this one though. Okay, take that. We got three emeralds now. Very nice. Nothing over here. All right, well, we've explored the whole village so far. Uh, and there's a trader. Let's see what the uh, trader. What do you have, Mr. Trader? Uh, nothing good. Huh? What? Let's see. For what is that? Mangrove popular? What's that? Need five though. I don't have five. What is a mangrove? Oh, for those mangrove trees. Oh, nice. Wish I had uh, more, more emeralds. I I may do that. Uh, offline and collect some of this some of their farm stuff and then trade it in for emeralds and then I could get that from that guy and then we could create a mangrove uh, area in our home base area all right I think at this point though uh, we're gonna end this episode we did find our cherry blossom forest that we we're looking for we got a bunch of saplings and some of its wood so we'll utilize that in our main base um, and like I said, I was, I'm going to fix that sorting uh, farm or sorting station that we have for the wool offline so that uh, you guys don't have to have, watch me build, but I'll show you the final product of it. And uh, now head back to base and you won't have to watch that either. Um, but I hope you enjoyed this episode. I uh, hope you're glad I'm back. And I will try to get back to a consistent recording um, pattern. It's uh, been, um, this is one of my, I, I love doing this, but it just seems like I haven't had a whole lot of time. But I'm going to try to make fun, some time to get this done for you guys. Uh, if you do like this video, please make sure you hit that like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, I would really appreciate it if you did. I'd love to have you as one of my followers on my channel. And I'll, as, as always, um, grow through gaming, connect with people, and have a great day. Thank you for watching.